Hello, this is Tosh Tais. I'm doing a battery on a Nissan Micra on a 2003 plate. These are the tools you need. A 13mm socket with a little extension. If you don't have a socket and a ratchet, you've got a 13mm spanner. And then you need a 10mm spanner as well. Now, this is the battery you need for the car. That's the part number right there. So if you ever did, this is a three-year warranty one. Now, to do it, it's a quite simple procedure. Just going to show you. Now, you've got a screw right in here. Right, that's a screw right there you got to undo first. So you've got a 13 mil. If they're tight, what you need to do is spray some WD-40. That should sort of kind of help it out, uh, free up a little bit. But once you've taken it out, make sure you don't drop it. So that's the bit. And the screw looks quite clean anyway. And then all you need is a 10 mil spanner. So undo the terminals. Now this is one of the most simplest battery. If you ever get stuck on the roadside, all you need is go 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 to a, uh, a part shop or something, get yourself a battery, and then you can replace it yourself as well. All you need is a 10 mil spanner, a 13 mil spanner, or a, or a socket if you've got it, if you've got the tools and everything. I'll push it back, take it out. Got a new one. Now the terminal, this is plus, that's minus, so that's plus, that's minus, so that's the way the battery would go. And then you've got the little bracket right on the back here as well. So if you, if you see a bracket here, you push the battery in, make sure the battery is all secure. You then get this bracket right here, so there's only one way that would go. So you then screw it in, so if you can screw it in by hand, which is good, i just done that. And then all you then do is... Just lock it up. Once you've locked it up, I can then nip it up uh, with the ratchet. But I then put the terminals in, put the terminals in, and then tighten it up. Just, just nip them up so they're not, they're not too tight. You don't want to really break it. That's good, that's good, and then with that one, all I now do is just nip it up so the battery is secure. All I'm going to do is start the car up, make sure it's all running well. That's lovely. Now, that's all done. If you ever need to replace anything such as batteries on, uh, if you haven't got a Nissan, if you've got something else, uh, just look at the bolt sizes, uh, whatever you think, just have a rough judgement, what spanners you require, uh, for another part of the company, you'll always have the battery size on the sticker itself, if you're not too sure, then phone your local garage up, give them your car registration, they will then uh, uh, tell you what battery it is and how much it is and if they will supply and fit it for you or you can grab it and fit it yourself which is quite simple uh, sometimes when you're stuck on the roadside you can't go to a garage or whatever you want to do it yourself this is the best way anything else you need to know let me know and uh, drop in a message do subscribe to our youtube channel as well please and uh, share the videos like it thank you very much goodbye